Good morning, it's Thursday the 11th of March. Just I'll let you have a look, see what I've done in here. I've put all the uh, spring cabbage and cauliflower in here. And uh, put a bit of lime round the ones that was in here to start with that don't look particularly brilliant, but one never knows, they might come on. And I brought the uh, tubs of crocus round because we have uh, got one that's showing colour. In here I've put uh, a row of turnips, whether they'll take or not, I don't know. And in here i put uh, four of the uh, Calabrese. <laughs> My memory's absolute zero. Four Calabrese and a couple of uh, all year round cauliflowers at the young end. Okay, I've took the beetroot out of here, I'm going to uh, empty this bed and uh, revitalise all the compost and then put, put it all back in and see how it goes. Now for a uh, carrot update. Temperature in here at the moment 19.9 Right, the big tub of carrots that I did I'm quite happy with that, I've uh, obviously removed a hell of a lot but I suppose there'll be some more stragglers will keep bobbing up that I'll take out but I'm happy with uh, how they're spaced out Now we've got uh, broad beans well on the way Little gem lettuce have uh, repotted, and these are the uh, early Nance carrots, three tubs. What I've done where there's been one missing here, there, and there, I have put some more seeds in, and the same in that tub, and the same in that tub. I have ordered some more new seeds because I think. Uh, I think they'll probably be on the way out shortly. Sweet peas are looking very, very good. And the Marman tomatoes are growing like crazy. Now what I've decided I'm doing, because I've got the heater on, I'm uh, putting them in the uh, light box until they germinate and then I'm bringing them in here. So there's Ladiba and uh, Greyhound cabbage, salad and lettuce, and Savoy cabbage, the others that you already know about. These are the potatoes that I had in the light box for a while that I set up in smaller pots. And then I brought one of these uh, sweet peppers in to see what develops. Pots repotted it on because having took it out of the existing pot it was uh, root bound. So depending on what happens with this one I might bring the other one in as well. This is a potato that I'm hoping to use on uh, Digwell's Green Fingers challenge, potato challenge by seeing how many potatoes we can grow off one. Um, I have two potatoes of this size but the other one's showing nothing at all so we'll wait on that one. Okay and I've also put in three tubs of Casablanca seed potatoes. There's three seed potatoes in each, uh, each tub. So we've got those moving on and it looks like I'm getting a, a flower on the uh, tumbling tom tomatoes so uh, looking good 
I've transplanted the uh, calendula. I've got 15 plants there to uh, grow on, hopefully. And I've put in 15 uh, cell trays, cells in a tray of uh, Kelvin Wonder. So, been a bit busy since the last uh, video that I did. So, um, things are looking uh, looking good. But I'm rather pleased with this lot. Having, I think I made the right mess of it to start with, with trying to do it Steve's way. But, uh, no, I'm happy with it. Okay, we'll catch you later.